Okay, set up your project folder. So in my case, desktop tutorial basics, put those three project files in here, as well as the source uh, tools add-on for Blender. First, we're gonna go ahead and open up Blender. It has to be version 3.2.1. Uh, left click the cube, press S to scale, type 20 to scale to 20 times its normal size. This is just because units are different. Rename the cube to cube underscore. So that, then drag that to scene collection. Next, come over here to materials, remove that material by hitting the minus there, then click new, and then double click this and rename this cube underscore text. This name here is case sensitive and references the VMT file. Okay, that's very important. That's what causes pink and black textures. Next, we're going to uh, add uh, Blender source tools. So go to Edit, Preferences, uh, Add-ons, Install, locate that file, which is Desktop, Tutorial, Basics, and then Blender source tools. Click Install Add-on. Check the box for Blender source tools, and then close that. Then come over here to the source, or sorry, scene, uh, Source Engine Export, Change this to SMD, export path, put that as the folder, except engine path is the Gary's Mod bin folder. So uh, C, program file, Steam, Steam apps, common, Gary's Mod bin, and then click accept, export, cube.smd, open the QC file. Uh, this references the name of the prop in Gary's Mod, that can be whatever you want to. This, this, and this, in this tutorial, for this scenario, have to be identical because we only have one SMD file. Um, the CD materials is the folder location of where the VMT file or files are. Okay, that's very important. That's case sensitive. So that can be saved and closed. Then you can come over here to the VMT file and base texture. Now this is linking to the VTF file itself, not the folder. So imagine .vtf is at the end of this. So it's the cube folder and then cube underscore text .vtf. Then you can save that. Come over to your materials folder here. We're gonna make a new folder, control shift N, call that cube because that's what we linked it under. And now we're gonna make the VTF file. So open up VTF edit, file, import, find your texture, Click OK, file save as, name it, cube underscore text, close that. You're going to have those two files there, copy and paste those to the materials cube folder that we made. Next, come to crowbar, come to decompile, or sorry, compile, and choose Gary's mod, locate the QC file, and then click compile. That's if there's no errors here, then it's successfully put it into Gary's mod. So we open up Gary's mod. Start a new game. And we search for cube. Not that cube. Okay. <laughs> and there we go. 